Welcome back, everybody, to some more Torna, the Golden Gundry. I'm your host, the musical gamer, standing in front of what could be the stairway to heaven. I, I have no idea, but it's a sacred staircase, and we're going to climb it. I have no idea what's at the top of here. I am just very curious. I'm a, I'm a curious sort today, and my curiosity might actually end up, you know, killing me. Holy Gate Camp. What the hell is this? Ah, this is new. The Rodney Holy Woods Gate of Altana? Can only be a good thing. What the hell? I, wait, I mean, I can't go in. I, ooh, hello. <laughs> I almost missed you. Oh God, can I even open you? Please tell me I can. You're coming with me. God damn it. God damn it to hell. God damn it to hell. Uh, I tried. I tried. I really, really did. Just, it wasn't meant to be. That's, that's just a shame. Um, let's go back to the Loft of Nature Preserve. I just want to take a look. Where the hell do these regions... Nice of pace. Where do these regions connect? Because I know they'll connect at some point. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, whoa. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hello. Doesn't this look familiar? Oh, I found a peach slate plate. Interesting. Yeah, I get the feeling that this was supposed to- Ooh. Well, that's a shame. If I were to just hop down from here. Yup! Now we're in- Ooh, we're in the Great Crater. Apparently this is actually a location. I must have missed it the first time. Me. We can't get this either. Great. Lovely. Why am I here? <laughs> like, what am I doing? This is this is not at all what I wanted. Um, okay, well the Great Crater is apparently something I could have put on the map a long time ago, and I never did. Interesting. So clearly it connects up over here. Uh, I bet you Animate of Money there's there's a location somewhere over here that connects to to um to the to the harbor. But eh, I don't really care too much to find it at this moment. I because I know we can't go through it. We need, I think, Swift Swordplay to be level 3, and I think we need to level 3 something else. This might be Focus, I'm not sure. But uh, I know the Swift Swordplay is definitely a requirement, and we don't have that. <laughs> we have... We're, we're not even close. I don't even think Jin has the right affinity level to get level 3 Swordplay yet. <sighs> so, we're not going to be able to do it anyway. So, we'll save it for later. It's not that big a deal. Um, you know what? I'm going to kill you. I need... I need redemption. Excuse me. Oh. Um... Okay, then. Hold on. Whoa, 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 hold on. Okay, thank you. Target this thing. Thank you very much. Target the thing that's actually attacking me, please. That would be lovely. I really appreciate that. Um... Let's see, we can do some ice too here. I think we need to do more chill strokes anyway. Ooh! Um, hey Adam, you want to switch to Mithra or something? And, uh, and smash him? That'd be, that'd be great. That'd be, that'd be, that'd be fan-freaking-tastic. No, apparently not. That's fine. That's fine. I don't need, I don't need to worry about making sure I get uh, blade and driver combos. I can just let them happen naturally now from this point rather than trying to force it myself. I mean, there's, there's, there's nothing wrong with it. Don't get me wrong. Blade and driver combos are freaking amazing and they do tons of damage. But at least especially with the driver combos, they're a bit tricky to coordinate when you're dealing with your AI companions. Oh, great. Um, you're the only thing it's got. Oh no, two of these things. Alright, that's okay. That's, that's, that's okay. It's that, wait, what? Oh god! Why, why are you here? You stop this. You stop this right now. Uh, can we actually get, like, this going? And can you, like, leave me alone? That would be great. Okay, let's, get a, let's get a gravity thing going. Come out, Jin. Uh, I want to pick this up. Thank you. Oh, Jin, get out of there. <laughs> Jin, like, get out of there, buddy. You're gonna, you're gonna get your butt kicked. Uh, this is not who I wanted to attack. I wanted to attack this guy, but apparently I did not want to. Whatever. We're, we're attacking him now. It's working. We're working. 
We're killing these things. We're dying. Slowly but surely, they're dying. Uh, we could actually, you know what? Fuck this. Let's, let's do a chain attack. We got the boost. We got the gauge. Why not? Uh, Jin, you go for first. Yeah, we can get one round more. Uh, Aegean, go. There we go, round two, bring it on. Uh, this probably won't kill him. At the very least, it's doing pretty good damage. Uh, Hugo, you're trying. He did some damage. I'm relatively sure we got people who still need to, you know, participate in chain attacks as part of their affinity stuff. I could have waited till we got like another element orb, but eh, not that big of a deal. Ooh, you stay strong, guys. I, you guys are getting hit real hard. Done. Yeah, you get out of here. Cascade Smash level three. In Layman, level 2. Nice, Aegean really got boosted from that fight. That's good to see. Hey, right, let's pop those and keep uh, going towards the capital. Boop Power and boop. Up from within. Nice, we defeated the Sable Wolf. Right, we needed to kill those for you. And we got, uh, we evaded 15 attacks. Nice. Good for you, buddy. You're that much stronger. We need to go check through people's lists again to make sure that we are killing everything we need to kill in these areas. And if I do miss... Oh, ooh, the great break sand. Doesn't this is an area, I think, that has things we need to kill. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fuck you, game. F whoa. Uh, oh, oh, oh. I get the feeling we're gonna get swarmed here. Why not? Let's fight. We're gonna die. This is, this is, this is gonna be the death of me. I'm like pretty much guaranteed this is gonna be the death of me. Let us all focus our efforts on this dude right here. Let's kill them one at a time. That's one dead. Let's get some heat going. Volt 2. There you go. Stone next. Why not? Uh, Jin. Come on out, buddy. Topple him. There you go. Go for some gravity. Cool. Green Art Level 2. Dance of the Flames Level 3. Terminal Flash level 3? Holy crap. Alright, fair enough, game. Fair enough. Maybe maybe that fight was actually worth it if we got all those affinity levels. I'm not going to complain. So this green barrel. We are nowhere near being able to actually open. Great. I found this area and I can do nothing with it. That is, don't you just love that feeling when you get to some weird, cool, out-of-the-way place and you can't do bupkis? Bupkis, I say. Bupkis. Uh, we defeated the... Oh, we had to kill those antels, actually. Fair enough. Hey, yeah, fair enough. Hey, right. good, good, good for you, Mithra. Whoa. <laughs> More growing to do. There you go, More. level three affinity for Minoth. I will make full use of this and skill. you hit Dance of the Flames, level three. Block 20 attacks, very good. I wish only to use and this. You have all your level two stuff, too. Majesty. You finish off five enemies. You will not shadow my liege's path. I'm sure you won't. Uh, use the... Right, we still need that favorite pouch item thing. Alright, well, we're, we're, we're climbing out of that, that ditch. The desert does have this weird, serene sort of beauty to it at night. I mean, you get these glowing plants, you get this... Why don't we... Oh, God! What are you? Oh, God! No! 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 Where am I? What the hell? What's... What's attacking me? What's going on? Oh no, you guys are not... Ooh... 
Yeah, you guys are you guys are not coming in this water. What in God's name? That's right, that's right. That's right, yeah, you come here. You come here. Oh god, are you gonna reach me here? I'm dead. I'm dead. Just kill me. Go ahead, just kill me. Go ahead. Get Excuse me? Uh, you missed me. Alright, just, just kill me. Just, 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 just kill me. Thank you. I, I should've done that sooner. I... I panicked. Okay. You, you know what? I, I panicked. Shut up! Shut up! I panicked! Anybody would panic. You got it. I just realized it. Wait a minute. This is gonna collapse on me. Ow. Ow. Okay. Yeah. This. This is. This is the same cave I was just in. This is. This is. This is the same cave. Oh ho! There's um. Oh my god. There's a thing. I know the trail. It's a thing. Don't mind me. Just this passing is through. Is I can't open this chest. Time to ski fucking daddle. Oh my god. Nope. You can't attack me when I'm on these things. Ha! Ha! Screw you, game. I know your tricks. Oh my god. Give me all the bugs. <laughs> Jesus. Alright. Alright, fine. We're out of there. Where the hell am I? Where am I going? What are the obstructive roots? Oh, come on, man. Can I please? Don't oh, thank God. Jin. Just, just murder these things. Get me through this area now. This is becoming a I know the trail. Oh. Yeah, the desert is a scary place, guys. Don't, don't, don't go to the desert. Just don't do it. Learn, learn from my mistakes. Learn, learn from the stake, the mistakes of Musical Gamer. He, well, no. he doesn't. Would you oh, look at that? Turquoise Plateau. What? Mordane has its fair share of wonders. Where are we? But nothing like this. Where the hell are we? This is becoming a Nature makes a fine ally. Ooh, this place is pretty. Oh my god, look at look at the pink trees and the in the in the in the little water up top. Oh, this is so nice. There's plenty of things here that wanna kill me. But you know what? I'm gonna look past it. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna let it bother me. We're just gonna enjoy the sereneness of this location. And not aggravate the wildlife. Because the musical gamer this is has learned not to aggravate the wildlife in this game. Because the wildlife will aggravate me. And I don't want to be aggravated. I just want to enjoy the sereneness, the beauty, the wonderful, wonderful nature's bounty found in this location. <sighs> Alright, well, uh, that, that, that's enough of that. This Let's just get the hell out of here. The capital is just literally right over there. Oh my god, after after all of that, I didn't even think I'd be able to see it at this point. But this you know what? <laughs> we made it. We friggin' made it. If we just if we just drop from over here, we don't do that. If we just drop from this place. Everything should be okay. I believe we can survive this fall. I hope we can survive this fall. Ow! My legs, but we're alive. We're alive with broken appendages, but it's fine. It's life still all the same. The sound of my voice. <laughs> it is fine. Looks like we actually made it. Dear God in heaven. 
I really didn't think we would make it. I thought for a minute I'd had to kill one of those things. Sleepwalker Mork. Now, we are actually higher level than it. I really wonder if we can kill it or not, but eh, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try it. Maybe in a couple more levels, like three or four more levels, we should we should give it a try. Hello, Mr. Treasure Trove. What you got for me? Ooh, lots of loot. Ooh, wait, missed something. There we go. Right, you know what I want to do? I want to change the time. I want to make it daytime. I want to go to town during the day. I don't want to see it at night. Boom. 8 o'clock. Done. It is 8 a.m. in the morning when we arrive. And that works for me. And look at that. It's the capital. Dead mm -hmm. ahead. Good Outriders stuff. Forest Trail. Doesn't seem so bad. Ooh. This is becoming Hello. something of an expert. It's a tree. What you got for me, tree? Rainbow resin, some other stuff. Cool. Cool. Some flowers. Oh, oh, look at this. Wow, they weren't kidding. The, this place is huge buildings. Look at this. People were saying. Welcome to Plainest Bridge. Anxious guard, well groomed guard. <laughs> well, we made it. Welcome to the capital of Torna, guys. Well, that's not right. What's not right? This Titan. Why isn't it in its real form? Wait, what? What do you mean? You noticed. What do you mean? That isn't the original form of the Torn and Titan. Huh? In ancient times, the Torn and Titan held awesome power. Torna made use of that power to dominate all the rest for a thousand years. Whoa, are you kidding me? Wow. Uh, you guys were dicks. You literally, like, attacked everybody, huh? But the power was shut away in the reign of Aleptos I. Since then, the Titan has looked like this. See that glowing sphere in the castle tower? That forms the seal. Is that what Malus is aiming for? Why would he do that? Wouldn't it be a threat to him too? Maybe he doesn't care. Truthfully, I don't know myself. Maybe he just revels in the chaos. But in any case, if he makes a move for it, it is clear what we must do. Agreed. You can see the palace in the distance. We should head there first. Offer our report to his majesty. All right. Sounds like a plan. Wow, look at this place. You know, it really is a shame this place doesn't exist in the main game. Oresco, the royal capital. Oresco main gate. Cool. Welcome to... Welcome to... To, to real Torta, guys. <laughs> this game's all rough today. I must have not had enough sleep. What do you think? I don't know how to say that to you. Oh, ox cores. You're talking about ox cores, huh? Torta's a bit behind the times, you've asked me. Orion is where it's at right now for grooming technology. I hear there's this thing that works directly on the cells to make them lustrous and moist. I'd love to try it. <laughs> so you tell me, Tor you tell me, tell me, Torta, in all of its infinite wisdom and technology. Uriah has better skincare products. Really? You're gonna go there, game? What age should a big brother stop making a little bro's packed lunch for him? Uh, what? I'm um, sorry, that's kind of a strange question to ask. You see, I've got this friend whose big bro makes his lunch. I mean, the little bro, it's not like he's a kid. I mean, he's grown. He, he can take care of himself. He even has a job doing guard duty in the gate, so he can make his own damn packed lunch. I'm old enough, damn it. Oh. <laughs> I mean, my friend. Uh, uh-huh. Sure. Sure. 
If he didn't waste his energy on all the fussing, he could be moving up in the world. I just don't get why he... Uh. You! You got, a, you got a doting brother, don't you? Don't you, buddy? Yeah, that's fine. You know, it's, it's better he dotes than he hates. It's my, my opinion. They will fill my belly. I'm not done eating yet. Delicacies and finery of torn and cooking are just about filling your face. If I get to save a legendary dish from that famous chef, my trip cannot be over. I came all the way from Moradain to tickle the taste buds with their legendary tastes. I'm going to get me some of Miss Sorrel's cooking and make this trip worth my while. And that's you. New customers. Hello. Welcome to the best restaurant in the capital, if I do say so myself. Although I have to admit I've had a bit of a rough time lately and it's affecting my cooking. I'm lucky to have regulars who will gladly eat here all the same, but I don't want them to be satisfied with less. Uh, sorry. Anyway, what are you looking to have a meal? I'll cook, but I can't really recommend anything. Uh, you, wow, you're, you're gonna go out of business eventually with that attitude, lady. I'm gonna tell you that much right now. Musical artisan, hello! Hello there, youngsters! Welcome! Are you looking for any instruments in particular this fine day? For beginners, I'd recommend the Torn and Viella. You'll be serenading your friends in no time at all. It's not many str it's got many strings, so it's simple to learn. There are also many good songs for beginners. It's a winner! Once you've learned some pieces, you can join an ensemble. It's a good way to improve in a hurry. We've even got a special event where people play the Torn and Viella to express thanks to the Titan. It's not an event to be missed. The music spreads through the air, so delicate and yet so strong. Thanks, dude. And you're a salesperson. What do you got? I know gloves. Ooh, these are some pretty good items. I might actually want to invest in some of them at some point. Hello there. All sorts of live here in the city, but everyone carries their own worries around. That makes us all alike. If someone came and asked you for help, you'd hear them out, eh? That's because you can empathize with them. That empathy is something the people you help will never forget. They'll support you, rain or shine. On top of that, once you make a name for yourself, new doors open up on account of your rep. But don't let that fame go to your head, and never think of others as smaller than yourself. It only causes pain. Remember that, and the bonds you make will stay with you throughout your life. Well, all right then. Thank you for the words of wisdom. We actually have a side quest over here. Loopy Inventor Gideon! Hello there. Ah, aspirant, aspirant youths! Stay right where you are! You have a look about you that tells me you might be interested in my most marvelous inventions! Here, look! I've hundreds of the things! Beauties, aren't they? More Ardain has absolutely nothing on my masterworks, I tell you! I am nevertheless at somewhat of a loss as how to surpass my former genius! What with war on the horizon, it's been getting more and more difficult to find the parts I need. So now I've laid my woes bare. Could you perchance help the great Gideon collect some machine parts? I believe the ones lying around here in Dorna should be choice enough. I mean, okay. Sure. I can, I can give you a hand. What do you need? You need some of this stuff. Hive is wire. Ooh. Okay, sure, here, yeah, take, 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 take these, take these. Look at these sunset brackets. I don't have anything else, unfortunately, but uh, when I do, I'll let you know. <laughs> You'll be the first to know. I'm going to name names of the certain countries where drivers use blades like they're disposable items. It's not just down to the humans, either. It's the blades go just go along with it. Like it's meant to be that way. It's so weird. Hmm. Take Torna, it's peaceful as anything, and humans, blades, and titans live together in harmony. Sometimes I wonder if it's made Torna a bit too soft. It's a good question. I mean, in peace times when things are really nice like this, that is when people start kind of losing focus of the big picture. You want to talk about insects, huh? I'll tell you, there's more than insects that meets the eye. Shiny shells or strong bendy legs. Plus, if you boil them up, you get some really useful medicines. Oh yeah. I've collected loads of insects, but because I'm a, just a kid, I'm not allowed to go looking very far. I need to get lots of insects because you're the bug collector, huh? I need some from Gormont, too. Well, nuts about bugs. Great. You meet all kinds of folks, don't you? I've got this. Okay, how about this? What can I give you? I've got. Oh my god, I got tons of these. How about a berry hopper? Sand Upa? Ooh, you like those, don't you? How about a munchy grub? Ooh, you like those, don't you? 
Um, Lejeure Swallowtail? Woo! Motley Cobra. You get eight points from that. I'll give you I'll give you the last one, sure, why not? And I'll just give you a couple of Lejeure Swallowtails. Call it good. Done. If I can boil these up and get her to drink it, just maybe... Wait, what? Whoa, 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 what are you doing with these? I don't think I did a good thing, guys. I think I just screwed over some poor girl. Oh I'm no. Happy we made someone happy. He seems satisfied with the bugs you found and hopes to use them for a medicine. He also sets his sights on a new invention. Oh god. Okay. You don't understand girls at all. Earlier I made a medicine from the Danic Weta and we collected and gave it to this girl I know to drink. She was like, ew, get that gross stuff away from me. What the heck is her problem anyway? It's made from bugs, dude! Who's going to want to drink it? You'll at least hide the fact what you made it from. How can a medicine made of 100% cool things be gross? Oh, I don't know. Gee, maybe because they're made of creepy crawlies. That, that could have something to do with it, man. God damn it. Uh, 14 generations craftsman, huh? Good, good for you, dude. We're just adding people to the community list at this point. We're just adding people. Oh, you make glass here. Your glass work, huh? Mow something. Yeah, fair enough. These people do have a lot of interesting things to say. I'm not going to really be, like, reading through all of them that... Um, out loud, at least. So, if I ever go Don't too fast, to feel twice. free to pause the video. Witness my oh, for fuck's sake. Hard luck. That's right. I need a stupid charm for you to get super strength level 2. God damn it. I'm talking about the Aegis... Because I literally can just read that fast when I'm not reading out loud. <laughs> I'm just... I'm, I'm, I'm a pretty speedy reader. So if I ever read too quickly, just 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 pause the video. You know what to do. Amateurs, what do you mean? <laughs> Fine, dude. Screw you. A concerned mother. This palace you're after, my lordships. Just follow those steps up and it's on the left. Oh, well, thanks. You're asking after the girl? It's my daughter Freya. She's been very frail since birth. An awful sickness. Oh, I wonder, are you the, you're the, you're the girl I just got the medicine for, aren't you? A bit shy lately. Lots of really neat shops. I'm sure, if you have a look, you'll find tons of stuff. Aw, poor kid. Well, I mean, <laughs> sorry you were probably forced to drink bugs. But hey, I mean, if it helps you. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. <laughs> At least that's the hope, right? Squad's job is to guard the palace, but they don't seem to anyone decent for this job these days. Bleed and shame. Problem is, the palace doesn't need a defending in so long. No invasion gets far enough to actually threaten it. Which is great, but it means our squad is short on real fighters lately. Everyone gets this job because of a family connection. Yeah, that's the problem about peacetime. Peace is good. Peace is great. But not so much. If it's a long period of peace and all of a sudden you get attacked. Luke. Hey, Luke. Royal Torn in Army. With those whopping long spears and really functional light armor. The inside of that armor is just... Man, they're so cool. This year, I'm definitely joining up. Well, good luck to you. The Viridian Gate. Loyalist Gardener. Sashram Gardens. So these are gardens, huh? Plentiful lands of lakes and forests, exotic cities with strange houses and even stranger food. But I have to say, there's no place quite like Torna. Big wars or famine or terrible epidemics here. Tonans live in peace and quiet thanks to our wise and prudent king. Past kings might have been brutal despots, but our king rules with reason and isn't afraid to change or reform. Some folks are critical of a king with a, such a progressive outlook, but I think he's clever. Very clever. It's fair. It's very fair. I like this. It's like, it's like this minimal sort of like zen garden type thing. It actually looks kind of nice. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's just a person. I thought it was like a interactable, like use field skills or something. Have you been enjoying some of the Torned sites? Yes, I have, Sarah. Thank you. It's plenty to see in the residential ward. There's a range of merchants and the artisans have their workshops there. The main tourist spot in town is the Aureus Palace, where the King of Torna lives. I didn't know this before I moved here, but the Royal Palace is so huge in part because it also houses workshops for renowned engineers and craftspeople. Ah! Interesting. These people working inside the palace, too. Cool. I guess we'll be able to take a look at that when we actually get
get to go in. Ah, this is new. Broadening one's horizons. The median gate. Be a good thing. Well, apparently we can't, um... Apparently we can't use it, and I don't know why. The Viridian Gate and the Median Gate. Now hold on, I need to see this from the other side. Can we actually go through this gate? Even not opening me for- it's not opening for me then. Vigilant. Tried racing with the trotting Armu. You lost. Great. I guess so. Oh yeah, don't die of boredom, kid. You're gonna need to find something else to do with yourself. Elderly Potter, hello. Reserve the might of the Titans, or revere. It's essentially our religion. It's not like we have much in the way of special rituals or rules. We just believe in respecting the life that surrounds us. Titans, humans, blades. We're all the same, really. That is a pretty zen outlook on life. I mean, hey, if it works, it works. Climbs there straight up to get to Sashim Gardens, pride of capital. And there, friends, can head to Aquila, or Aquila, 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 I don't know. Watchtower, rainbow over to Arrayus Palace. Not to Miss Gardens, beautiful place of calm and recently traveling bard set up with wonderful music too. Off gate closed, Rikoko recommend going around and entering from side of shopping ward. Well, I mean, the gates are closed. There's no way in. Why the hell are these gates closed and the other ones open? I have no idea. Well, anyway, we made it to the kingdom of Torna's capital. We are going to go take a look inside the palace next time. And let's play some more Torna, the Golden Country. Thanks all for watching. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. Catch you guys next time.